Hey, welcome back to Triple R Random Rick Reviews. Today we're going to review some Xena comic books. Uh, the Tops run, a Dark Horse run, and a Dynamite run. Uh, I think there's currently another run going on. I'm not sure who has it. Um, so these are pretty cool. These are the initial ones. So from a few years back. So they did screenshots on some of the covers and they did alternate with art. So let's check them out. Okay, so let's take a look at the Xena comic book lineups. Uh, I think Tops was the first one to do it. Bold well, first issue, Tops, screenshot. And then they did alternate covers with actual art. Not too crazy about this art. And you got the screenshot, two of three. Art started to get quite a bit better. Here's the third of the series. I, uh, I don't have the alternate to that, it doesn't look like. Um, here was the initial one. CZ0. Screenshot, the alternate. And we did another storyline, Wrath of Hera. Which we also had screenshots. Along with art. And it looks like he did the third, the Orpheus Trilogy. There's the art. Xena vs. Callisto. Then Tops also did Xena and Joxer. Again, a screenshot. And the art. Nothing there. And Dynamite did a run. Uh, Army of Darkness with Xena. This is the only one I have of that right now. So no alternate art for that. But they did do regular Xena series dynamite so, that's a one two I don't think there's alternates no. three and four and Dark Horse was the other studio so he also did screenshots Along with art. And here's some extras I just picked up because it was a bundle and I wasn't going to pass that up. Alright, so there's a Xena comic book collection of mine at least. Uh, they're pretty cool. I'm definitely a fan of the show. The comics are pretty cool. I like they did screen and art. So if you're a Xena fan, I suggest picking them up.